Got one. It ate it on the fall. Whoa, my gosh. What's up, everybody? Derek here. Today we're down on the river shooting some rapids to go smallie fishing. And I was going to film an intro right here. I didn't even make it that far. See this big rock right here? Well, the kayak got wedged sideways up against that rock somehow right before I was going to shoot around it. So I was able to grab my backpack and my rods here in both hands and not worry about the kayak. I was able to grab my paddle and throw it to shore. So I've got everything except for one tackle box that floated downstream, but it's a waterproof case, so we'll find it eventually. But what I've got rigged up is a walking topwater bait, a Texas rig baby brush hog, and just a weedless sen or a, a Sanko, weightless Sanko. So hopefully we'll go down here and we'll catch the smallmouth or largemouth or whatever ends up biting. So let's go. All right. Here we go. Shoot these rapids. Hopefully my tackle box is down here somewhere. Thing. I have no idea, but it already looks. Ooh, we need to be careful getting sideways. I'm trying to get over here to get out of it. All right, here's what we're going to start with this little Excalibur walking bait. Hopefully, there's some smallies or largemouth or something along these walls where this current's at that might want to come up and smack it where there's some bolt or some big boulders down there. So, lots of places for them to hide. Right in front of me is just one big old drop. It's got to be some smallies down in there. It's large mouth, anything. I'm going to try right up here where that drop is, right there on that shelf. Pull it down that. It just looks too good of a spot for one not to be hanging out. Let's do it. Oh, is that it down there maybe? Or am I just getting excited? I can't tell. I think that's it. There she is. My tackle box. That's it, right there. It's just sitting there waiting for me. Ah, it held water, but it still floated. Dang. That ain't cool. But at least I didn't lose it. I thought these things were supposed to be waterproof, but maybe not. All right, back to the brush hog. Let's thoroughly work this area. See if there's anything down through this little stretch. And going downstream and maybe we'll find some fish not much has been happening lately there's a fish at least it feels like one. Oh yeah that's a good one right there whatever that is oh oh yeah it's a smallie the first one it's just a little guy but man they're fighters that's awesome there we go pretty little guy pure smallie thanks bud 
All right, let's see if we can do that again. Just all the way over there, and I was just dragging it real slow. I wasn't even really working it. Oh, I just came up the, the falls, and about a one pound smallmouth just went right up. They're in here. They're definitely in here. Just not catching them. And I got a blowout. <laughs> My shoe decided to blow out. It's barely hanging on by a little piece of the front toe part. So it's kind of tough going upstream in rocks, but let's come right up here and see if we can't maybe catch one. Oh, that reel. Got one. It ate it on the fall. That's that feels like a good one. Oh man, this is a good one. Whoa, my gosh! It ate it on the fall. Oh yes. Oh, this is a real good one. Come here, baby. Oh gosh. Come here. Don't break it. Oh yeah, oh my God, look at how fat that thing is. Whoa, that is a little football. God, I wanna weigh this thing, see how much this one weighs. This is a big one. God. <laughs> That is awesome, but man, I can't believe that thing's been eating good. All right, I'm gonna get my clip here so I can put it on the side. Let's just see. I know this thing weighs 0.3 because I've weighed this, this clip before. So this clip is 0.3. Let's get that right in there. What's up, bud? All right. Okay. Tear that. Oh. 2.92. Minus 2.3, that's a two and a half pound bass. That is awesome. Man, that is such a good looking bass. Such a pretty, pretty gold. Well, I think I found my little piece of heaven out here. I have not caught a smallie like that in a long time, especially on a river. It's been a long time. I'm originally from the Ozarks and this is probably some of the closest kind of fishing to the Ozarks that I have found up in Arkansas. I mean, the hills aren't as big. I mean, there's not moss in the trees unless you go in Southern Arkansas, but it's just pretty out here. Football jigs, mainly I caught one on that, that baby brush hog, but it's just awesome kind of fishing. I love going to places like this and trying to figure them out, but the kayak did good. I recovered from that earlier crash. I wish I would have had my GoPro on. Man, that would have been an awesome crash video because I straight up had that thing sideways. I mean, that thing was wedged up against the rock sitting like that with all that current just pouring up against it. And it was actually upstream of here, but whoo, man, what a day already. But thanks for watching you guys and subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video if you liked it and I'll see you guys in the next one.